Yeah, you guys, Captain Ross Amer says this is real. It's definitely happening. But the question that he has is, should we actually do it? Are the skies over Los Angeles ready? George Jetson. That was my dream that someday we'll have flying taxis. If Uber has its way, personal air taxis won't just be a cartoon, but a reality. And soon, according to Bell, one of Uber's flying taxi partners, next year over the skies of Los Angeles, they will start testing the five person hybrid electric powered vehicle with six tilting ducted fans that can land anywhere. The model, called the Bell Nexus, is expected to fly passengers around the Southland by 2023. Was this something you'd want to try out? No, <laughs> I wouldn't want to try it out. But I don't think we're ready for it yet. Retired United pilot Captain Ross Amer now flies private jets. He's concerned the new drones won't mix well with other air traffic, including 43,000 commercial airliners flown a day in the U.S. The technology is not there yet to mix thousands of commercial traffic, private traffic, helicopter traffic, and then literally thousands of small airplanes flying everywhere. Now you mixed all of that. That's going to create some crazy situations. More than the traffic, Amer is worried that the unmanned aircraft could be weaponized. And I hate to say what nefarious activities could do to that unmanned aircraft. I think that would be pretty interesting. I mean, if they could make it safe. Sounds scary at first, but you know, I drive my car and I put it on autopilot and yeah. it actually drives me down the freeway with no problem. So still a lot of bugs to be worked out, but we will know a lot more when they start testing this air taxi next year. In Mission Viejo, back to you guys.